Well, going green and recycling resulted in uh, big dividends for the city last year. Yeah, but the city thinks that it can make even more money if residents recycle more efficiently. A new study conducted by a consulting group is giving city officials a better idea of how Honolulu residents are recycling. 160,000 households on Oahu have blue, green, and gray carts to get rid of their trash and recycle other products. Ray Tadaki takes out his carts religiously. On Mondays with the blue, on Tuesday, uh, Wednesdays with the gray, and then the following Monday with the green. But not everyone thinks it's easy. Su Zhang recently moved into her house after living in an apartment complex. Recycling, at least to me, is extremely confusing. I mean, can we recycle cardboard? Do we put that in the recycling bin? According to a study completed by the Cascadia Consulting Group hired by the city, the curbside program has a 52% capture rate. That means the, the people who are participating in the recycling program, that, uh, re, that those recyclable products that can be going into the blue bin that are actually going into the blue bin. Last year, the city netted $1.5 million by collecting 18,000 tons of mixed recyclables. If residents can increase their recycling capture rate to 75%, the city would make an extra $500,000 in revenue. I'd like to see us up around 75% capture rate. And I'd like to see it sooner than later, but it's and it's a challenge, you know, getting that last mile is hard. Some residents think that goal is possible, but changes need to happen. Yeah, I think they need to remind people what goes into the bins. They need to educate us. I think if they'd send us flyers, mail, and just remind us, and, or on TV, ads. Now, the city is currently in phase two of its recycling study to see how many of the 160,000 households that have the carts actually use them. Residents will receive surveys starting this month through March, and you can go to our website, KITV.com, and click on the As Seen On section to review the guidelines on what can and what cannot be recycled.